There are things that rub us off our peace without us knowing. We entertain them daily and they add no value to our lives. You would wonder why some people would keep something that hurts them so close to themselves. The answer is simple because you have formed a habit of keeping it there. Our habits and thoughts can make us unhappy. According to Lifehack on the issues of unhappiness, unhappiness comes in many shades of grey. Sometimes people just lack joy, while depression and other psychological diseases are certainly a clinical illness and should not be minimized. There are also factors that contribute to feeling down that you can influence. What our goals should be is to minimize other factors that contribute to this. In today's video, I will be sharing 20 little things that secretly make you unhappy. If you're new here, consider subscribing to our channel for more awesome videos such as this one. Number 1. You worry too much This is very important to stop if you are ever going to be happy. Why are you so sad? Why do you worry about everything? Has your worrying solved any of your problems? No one's worry have ever or will ever solve any problems. Let go of the things you can't change. It is not your fault you were born black, nor is it your fault you were born into a poor family. What you can change though is your narrative. Choose who you want to be instead of worrying about who you are. 2. You don't admire the beautiful things of life Imagine watering a flower pot in a garden in the afternoon during summer. There are some delights from nature that a corporate office will never replace. Make out time each day to just bask in the warmth of the sun. A phone will not give you this feeling. The breeze on your skin is far more soothing than Taylor Swift or Ed Sheeran. Trust me, take a walk at least once a week. Just leave the house. Don't always use logistic companies to order pizza. Take a bus. Walk down to Domino's yourself. 3. You walk all the time Work can be fun, but working all the time isn't. The human body is not built that way. You are meant to get rest and recuperate before continuing. Some people haven't had vacation in three years. They just work and work and work. It is as though they are hiding from something and if they stop working, they will finally be confronted with it. It is a bad idea to use work to hide the pain. It is very unhealthy. Instead, deal with it head on and move on with your life. Number 4. You have no friends It is normal not to have friends at this stage. Friends are, after all, distraction in some instances. However, Having even just one friend is good. At least, you have a buddy you can get a cup of coffee with and celebrate during their birthdays. Life can be pretty boring without friends. Imagine waking up one day with cancer and your parents are late and you have no siblings. Who will you call? No one prays for trouble, but having friends make it easier to bear. Can you imagine what a wedding would look like if no friends attended? It will be quiet and people will find you odd. 5. You hold grudges How long are you going to be angry at someone? Are you willing to stay angry even at the cost of your own unhappiness? Do you not see that it is foolish to stay angry at a person who has moved on? You need to let go. It is one of the little things that make a person unhappy. When you have a big grudge against someone and it has been years, you would forget it and then remember if an occasion were answered. It is bad for the mood and should not be allowed to remain in a person's life. 6. You want everyone to play fair Unfortunately, life doesn't work that way. Imagine if everyone was following the law. Do you think there will be criminals? Probably not. Our sad reality is that utopia can only be achieved internally. You can't force the person next to you to confirm his life to the right principles and to work hard. Imagine the government forcing people to live responsibly and not drink themselves to stupor. The government may actually be toppled in days. Then you will wonder how such a good intention can be met with such resistance. Freedom, after all, does have a price. 7. You think you can control things A lot of people have thought they could control things. Unfortunately, nothing in life is within anyone's control. You can do your part as a human. But the rest is ultimately not up to you. For example, purchasing the right stock is still subject to the market, which is outside your control. Living peacefully is largely outside your control because there can be war at any time. This, again, is outside your control. Even the internet everyone relies on so much can become cut off. How then will you survive? 
Trying to control anything is a futile gesture that is bound to keep you unhappy. Do your part and let it be. 8. You compare yourself with others all the time. At the stage you are in, it is natural to want to be rich and successful as some of your age mates in different fields. As you advance in age, you will come to realize that there are more important things in life. For example, someone can be extremely wealthy and have children who make him feel miserable. Someone else may not be as wealthy but have a very happy home. All the people know that being happy is better. If you have $100,000, it is okay. Everyone has different parts in life. As long as you are working towards your goals, be happy with your progress. Everyone doesn't start at the same time. Number 9. You tie your friendship to the attainment of future goals. When you want something so badly, the tendency is to tie having it to your happiness. But this is dangerous. So what if you don't get it? If you don't get it, you will be devastated. You should not take such risks. It is better to have goals and work towards them. Whatever happens along the way, you take it in good faith. 10. You feel lonely. Everyone feels lonely at one point or another. With young people, it is more rampant. Working very hard to meet your financial goals can come with a lot of pressure. Sometimes, you can work so hard you don't remember to rest. When this happens, you feel like your only company is work. You'll get so good at it and you may not have anyone to discuss those things with. You will just be on your own. So, what can you do to change this? For starters, you can go out more often. People after all make friends when they go out, not when they are behind their computers working. 11. You pursue material things above all things. While working hard to make money is not bad, doing it to the point of burning all the bridges of principles is bad. You need to know where to draw the line. You will be wealthy. You shouldn't engage in shady deals to get wealth faster. Once you begin, there will be no going back for you. It will be one thing after another until you are so lost you cannot recognize yourself anymore. 12. You don't make time for your family. Family is an essential thing in a person's life. You should always make out time for your family. They are ultimately the only ones that care about you. 13. You don't forgive yourself. As much as you are meant to forgive others, don't forget to forgive yourself. Don't be too hard on yourself. We all make mistakes. We all deserve a second chance. Why not you? You were drinking and went to rehab should not be the end of your life. It can even be the backbone of your turning point, the point when your life transformed after you said no to drugs. Don't be afraid to step out and push for your dreams because of your past. Your past doesn't define you. You do. Number 14. You hang out with sad people. Don't hang out with people who make you sad. It's pointless. How exactly are you going to be happy when you are in the company of people who have no joy? Such companies also partake in joyless activities like smoking and drinking. You really don't want to get involved. 15. You live in the past. Let go of the memories of the last which prevent you from moving forward. It doesn't matter how long it has been or whether you feel strong or not. You have to make progress. You deserve better. 16. You want everything to be perfect. The person who wants everything to turn out exactly as planned will worry until the results are out. 17. You don't take risks. Risks are by their nature uncertain, but they are the things that help you to push for the unknown. The courage to do this usually yields bountiful results. Not taking them and seeing other people succeeding at it can make you unhappy. 18. You don't get enough sleep. A well-rested you is always going to have a better mood than a poorly rested you. 19. You are afraid of failure. Isn't everyone? Don't allow the fear of failure to prevent and to hold you back from leaving. Number 20. You are insecure. There are people who are so insecure about their life. They are insecure about their jobs, their looks, and even their color. Cheer up. Where you are currently is someone else's dream. Be grateful.